Adam Cochran here with HelpMeRick.com and another short, intuitive, and interesting video tip. This one is one of my favorites. Uh, often I tell people I stumbled across a website the other day and I tell them all about it and they don't realize that I wasn't just speaking figuratively, I was also speaking literally. I, found, I find websites all the time using a tool called Stumble or StumbleUpon. You can find this tool at StumbleUpon.com and what you do, you go on over to StumbleUpon.com, you sign up for a free account, it doesn't ask you any personal information that you don't want to give away. You just give them a username and a password, but then also a vital part of setting up your account is checking a series of boxes that indicate all of the different interests that you may have. And you'll find all kinds of things in there. You'll find news, you'll find information, you'll find government conspiracies, jokes, cartoons, anything. And you even have options to check whether you want to see family-friendly stuff or whether you want more adult-oriented stuff as well. But you'll find all kinds of things. Once you've installed the tool, you'll have a little toolbar up in the very top, or you can move it to the bottom wherever you'd like, a little button up here that says Stumble. As you click on that Stumble button, it will take you to all kinds of websites. Now, I went through and I checked about three quarters of the options that it gave me just so I could get a more interesting experience as I did stumble upon. But as I come across something I enjoy and I want to see more sites like it, I'll just keep stumbling. As we go through, we find something that we'd like. You can click on the Like It button. If you don't want to see more sites like it, you, like you see the same thing over and over and over, you can just click the Don't Like It button, which is a thumbs down. You also have an option to send it to somebody, and I can send it to uh, different friends that I may have just by adding an email, and it will share that information with them. You can also look at all different kinds of information, such as who shared this, so that you can uh, visit websites. You might be able to find websites that another person liked uh, that shares the same interest as you. You can add it to favorites. You can do all kinds of great things. So StumbleUpon is a great tool that you can use. You just keep on clicking that stumble button and you'll find all kinds of uh, information, entertainment, and time wasters that you never knew existed. That's StumbleUpon and you can find it at HelpMeRick.com. I'm Adam Cochran with HelpMeRick.com. Thank you very much. Have a good day.